Welcome to Dark Horizon Creations. I'm Mike. This time we're taking a look at the Star Wars Mission Fleet Stellar Class Luke Skywalker X-Wing Starfighter by Hasbro. Now if you haven't already, please follow, like, and subscribe to my social media accounts on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. Don't forget to hit that bell icon so you get a notification of when I post new content. Okay, so here we have the Star Wars Mission Fleet Stellar Class, Wave 4, Luke Skywalker, X-Wing Fighter. And I picked this up this afternoon in an area Walmart. This is the first time that I've purchased anything in the Mission Fleet line. So this playset is based on the appearance of Luke Skywalker in the Season 2 finale episode of The Mandalorian. And of course, it does include the Luke Skywalker, Jedi Knight, and Grogu minifig, along with the X-Wing Starfighter. Really cool packaging. I like the design of the box. I think that's really neat. I like the artwork. Showing the toy in an action sequence. On the back of the packaging, you have your obligatory product shots of the X-Wing Starfighter and the minifigs. And one of the things that I really like about this line, and I've previously seen this, even though I've never purchased these toys, is that this is a 1-1 scale image of the toys inside the packaging so you know exactly what you're getting. There's no guesswork involved in buying any of these toys in the Mission Fleet line by Hasbro. Okay, so here we have Luke Skywalker, his X-Wing Starfighter, and that little green thing that looks like a booger outside of the packaging. Now, before we begin, also included is some sort of attempt at an instruction sheet that we obviously don't need. First and foremost, let's talk about the minifigs and let's begin with Grogu so we can get rid of him. Um, yes, that's all sorts of cute there and his ears are soft plastic. There's no articulation. It's just a little molded booger wrapped in some sort of outfit. That's all that he's made of right there. That's it. Nothing else. And here is Luke Skywalker, Jedi Knight. His cloak is removable if you so choose to do so. It's made out of soft rubber. You can see he does include his light saber. As far as articulation, his head will swivel left to right. And forward and lateral movement of the shoulder, shoulder rotation, and his elbows don't bend. His wrists do swivel. And no waist swivel. Forward movement at the thigh. And I do believe that is all of the articulation for these action figures. Okay, so let's talk about the X-Wing itself. And despite the design of this, of course, for younger collectors and fans, I still like it. I think it is really neat. It has a single forward landing strut, which will retract. A little difficult to get it to extend and lock into place. You've got these ports all over the ship for the accessories that cannons and things you can buy. You've got it molded in R2-D2 and his dome will swivel. You've got a opening cockpit and bare minimum molded detail on the interior. And the S-foils will open and lock into position. I have to say these uh, laser cannons are hollow on the bottom. That's really disappointing. In my opinion, this is worth $5 and $5 only. Now for those curious about the dimensions of the X-Wing, tape measure, and it is right at eight and a half inches in length. 
right at six and a half inches wide. So now that we've taken a look at the minifigs and the ship, let's see how they fit inside the cockpit. So we'll take Luke, and I presume he's supposed to fit inside with his cloak. I guess that's possible. Some fashion, maybe not. I guess Grogu just kind of sits in his lap and plays with stuff while Luke attempts to fly the ship. Overall, I think it's a really neat toy for what it is. They're great for younger collectors and fans. Maybe you're an adult collector like myself and, and you like the ships and vehicles. I wouldn't invest a lot of money and time in it. There you have the Star Wars Mission Fleet Stellar Class Wave 4 Luke Skywalker's X-Wing Starfighter by Hasbro.